<laughs> too many, too many stories to share. I, I'm afraid I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's okay. <laughs> that's no, I mean Plus honestly, time. I mean there we've been we've been uh, in Indonesia for two and a half months. Wow! And every day we were looking at each other like, wow, it's so beautiful, you know. Martin, right? Yeah, it's Martin, Martin. It's actually Martin, but you know, Martin, Martin is fine. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? Good, good. Thank you so much for your time. It's a pleasure to talk to you. Of course. Thank and you. To talk about this intense movie. I think not just physically, but emotionally as well for you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when yeah. you so let's start like when you read the script, what was like, what got your attention on this project? Uh, I mean, the, the script was as intense as the film. So, um, I mean, I know I've, I've known Jim um, for a while because he actually called me that he was working on this film and he, that he was, um, you know, he was with me in, in his hat for the um, for the lead part. And this is this is like nine years ago. So um, he contacted me very early. In the, in the very early stadium of the film, and um, so I've, I've I've read quite some different versions of the script as well. So I've kind of seen it develop um, to what it it has become. And the film is is quite a you know one on one uh, with what the script was. And like the did you have like to 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 do like a special preparation for it, like any type of exercise and how to handle the riffle can you talk a little bit about it <laughs> yes definitely we uh i mean it's been a it's been a long and and um and intense um way of preparation both physically and and mentally or intellectually um so we've been training physically in the gym because we had to be able to carry around all this armor and all this uh, stuff as soldiers in a country where it's um, like 35 40 degrees celsius every day and um, then we had military training to uh, what you said you know like be able to handle the guns in the right way that they did in that period because that's it's all different from how they do it now so um uh, yeah, that's what we did and we learned like, um, you know, uh, offense techniques, body techniques, um, stuff like that. And then also it was like a, a study of, you know, the historical, the, the historical um, um, context of the film, because I didn't know anything about the whole situation. I, uh, it was a completely, completely new for me. And um, as it is for, for a lot of people still in Holland and abroad, definitely like what happened with, with the Dutch colony at the end of, um, of you know, yeah, the, the colonial war. So, um, yeah, there was a lot to learn. Yeah, I can only imagine because you have, yeah. it, it, there is like very difficult scenes like, and, you know, you guys put a lot of like physical effort and everything that's why and I think you guys did a really good job like the the whole actors like the group of actors I think you guys like looks like there we are actually on the on the war like as a group as a yeah as soldiers all together and and what do you sometimes we 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 really enjoy our character what do you like the most about your character jo Johan Joan um you know the things that that were really interesting to um to play is uh, i mean the fact that he's he's walking around with a big secret all the time uh about his dad or about his family um that's that's a that's an interesting element and um also the the whole arc of the character you know in the film it's just it's it's huge there's a, there's such a big development. He's going through so much stuff, and then you have these flash forwards in the film that 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 really gives such a 
big contrast to it. So to be able to portray that um, that arc and um, yeah, I mean, these are two of the many elements that were really interesting to play. Yeah, I like it because like in the beginning when he says, oh, I don't have family and they are all dead. And then <laughs> like in the, and then goes in, involving the, the, it's, it's interesting to me yeah. to see yeah. that because he doesn't want to know anything about his past. <laughs> Let exactly. it there. Yeah. Yeah. You mentioned like that you start this, like this project together, like with Jim, not that you started, but you involved it since the beginning with Jim. How was like work with him? How was like he, 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 he let you guys improvise. You need to stick to the, to the, to the script. How was like this collaboration? It was, it was very, um, you know, he's, he's, a, he's someone who doesn't need a lot of words to be able to know what he, on what he, um, you know, to understand what he means or what he wants. Um, and that, that also means that he's kind of giving, giving you a lot of trust to sort of figure it out yourself, or it's his way of saying, you know, you know, you know what you have to do. Don't worry, don't worry. You don't have to ask so many questions. You know exactly what you have to do. Um, I mean, that's that's that was something that I really liked about working with him. And then also, he's just really he's he's fun. He he knows that um, having fun on doing your job uh, is is the best way of you know creating creating something together. If everybody is stressed out, if everyone is just having a hard time because um, because the whole situation, you know, like shooting a film in in, in Indonesia is quite a um, is, uh, is quite a challenge. Um, but he always he was always in a good mood, you know. Um, I think that's that's a level of you know being professional as well. So that's uh, definitely something that that stuck with me. And, and, and something I will remember on future projects to just always have fun. Yeah, I think that's important. We 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 should have fun all the time. Yeah. <laughs> like at least try to to enjoy. I mean, with with respect to to the story, of course. I mean, yeah. we, we know what we're making. We know what we're um, what we're filming about. What the film is about, and 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 definitely there are a lot of scenes in the film. As you've probably seen, that that are not fun at all. Um, so, but I mean, I mean, on a on a on a general level, just have fun. Yeah. 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 Talking about like the scenes, like the most difficult ones, like the very difficult ones. Do you have like a the what was like the most challenging one for you to to do it? Um. Well, I think uh, w without without spoiling too much, but like the villages, the the scenes where we sort of um, yeah, how would you call it? Go th go through the villages. <laughs> um, those were definitely the. I mean, that was the, those were the hardest scenes that I've ever done for any project, um, and it also had to do with the fact that. Um, the the extras, uh, which were like um, over a hundred uh, people, they were really locals from, you know, over there the, from a village where we were shooting, who were being asked uh, to help, you know, as ec extras uh, and play villagers. And I was so amazed by the uh, the level of believable acting it was so, I mean. Uh, what I'm trying to say is that these people just really understood what we were making a film about and they didn't read the script, you know, they, 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 they weren't like really part of the project, but they know, they knew exactly what we were filming. And that said so much for me about why it was so important, why it's so important to make this film. Yeah. Um, it's on the, it's that part was a, of an their, impressive their, experience. Yeah. It's part of their history. They might. I don't know. Sometimes it's over there. They just a click to remind. I don't know. It's 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 amazing that you say me that because I thought that it was like extras 
that they hire <laughs> not local people that actually lives lives there but that's yeah it. yeah 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 it's amazing uh, you you had uh, there is a this relationship with the the your character uh, develops with the turk yeah. <laughs> i was like i was like this collaboration with with Mar maran kenzari and and how do how do you guys prepare that because it's it there there's a, there's some talking but not a lot it's 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 interesting the way that you guys look at each other it looks like that you guys are sending a message it's interesting that the chemistry you know that you guys had yeah um well I, 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 he's a marwan is a very impressive guy himself so uh and he he's done some amazing projects and he's played in big international films so he's definitely someone that i as as an actor and 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 on a personal level look up to so that uh that chemistry or that that uh, sort of um you know it was already there there wasn't there wasn't a lot to be played because i i think the um the way johan looks at turk is quite is quite similar and um yeah so that that was that was basically what what really helped uh in that in that um in those moments of eye contact i think yeah now it's very interesting and all all the other actors like i i you you talk you talk about fun that you guys have fun but there is anything interesting or fun that you can share with us that happened on set while you guys are filming <laughs> too many too many stories to share i i'm afraid i can't <laughs> <laughs> i know that's okay that's no i mean classic. honestly i mean there we've been we've been uh in indonesia for two and a half months wow and every day we were looking at each other like wow it's so beautiful you know like we we're shooting a film in indonesia it's it, it's been a really special experience and um everyone was also kind of on their own little journey um you know um, i mean i i was i was i was there on set literally every day because i was in every scene um and other guys were only there a few days a week so so every, everyone was also kind of on their own journey so um i was i was kind of a lone wolf actually on this uh, on this project um but but i mean no it's it's been it's been an amazing journey and i'm sure everyone will definitely remember this for the rest of their lives definitely no that's for sure and and aside from from this project do you have anything else coming up for you uh yeah definitely i'm working on a new project right now i'm i'm, I'm finishing um uh, still finishing a film that we shot earlier this year um so yeah it's um it's it's going okay <laughs> yeah but that, that's well. good yeah. that's good the, the way that the, the world like is right now i think it's we are very blessed to to do to be doing something i think definitely and, yeah yes and 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 do you have like someone any director or any an actor that you'd like to to work with in the in the future I get that question quite a lot, but it's such a hard, hard one to answer though, because there are so, so many actors and directors on so many different levels as well that, that are just interesting to work with. I mean, of course I, I, I dream of working with Martin Scorsese, but that's like, uh, you know, dreaming. So, um, I think on a, on a very, on a lower skill, there's, there are so many interesting makers, European, American, English, um, Asian, everywhere. There's there there are being there are so many interesting creative people. So um, it it'd be really cool to to have this film open up maybe like a, a wider range of um, contacts all over the world. People you know to be able to work with them, a lot of different kind of people. Yeah, you never know. Let's throw that on the universe. You never yeah. know who's be watching the interview. Let's see what so. happens. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, maybe that happened. You know, Mart Mart Martin 
I just want to thank you so much for your time. It's a pleasure to talk to you. A lot of success and keep going because you're very talented. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. Of course. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. If you like this video, don't forget to comment, to like, and subscribe to our channel right here.